tonight. Um, this is a dream that I had for a very long time to gather artists together and promote uh, humanitarian causes. Uh, to be honest, I in the past never trusted galleries uh, and I must say that Belgravia Gallery has proven that uh, there are wonderful galleries full of humanitarian intentions. Uh, my name is Johan Kelp. Um, I'd just like to start by saying that I am uh, absolutely honored to be here. Uh, I've been asked by the Playing for Change team to come and represent them tonight. Um, I would like to also say on their behalf uh, how delighted we were to be involved in this project. Um, uh, I would also like to congratulate all of the winners tonight and indeed everyone who's taken part. Um, I think the quality of the work uh, on show here speaks for itself. Um, and I think you, everybody has done an amazing job. As you can see, white, which is a global colorful piece, is the same for us here in Africa, particularly for me, we have Maasai. The Maasai believe in colors a lot, and uh, that's where my inspiration came from, where you can see the white, which represents peace. And then definitely black. I am black. Many times we are called the dark continent. By that I mean we are so dark is because we are so mysterious. We are full of so many cultures. This is so many cultures. Full of uh, so much strength, so much passion, so much culture, so much artwork. But other than that, here black represents war and conflict and corruption and everything that you can think of in terms of black. And then I have the red there, which is representation of life, sacrifice, and peace. I know, no, sorry, peace. But conf I mean, it's a sacrifice, life, and love, and all the passions that go with the color red. And the embedded color, which is green, represents uh, corruption, greed, money, conflict that is actually the cause of all the war in the world. We know what peace is, but at the same time, it's a very abstract thing in our mind. We, we, you know, peace, we cannot touch peace as such. Or... So, I had to work on that in my mind. And, but initially, what I wanted to make like a contrast somewhere in my painting, where this on the sides, that was immediately in my mind, I had to do that. That was just it's kind of like, it could be smoke, it could be um, something lava, or it could be something um, but eventually it came out as if they are wings coming from certain ashes maybe and opening up as the V and I wanted to give that peace for me. I'm a very optimist person and I believe that peace would eventually overrule anything and, and goodwill especially. But for I had to make it something uh, very, very straightforward and, and that with a symbol, and, and this is why I did this, the egg, which is for me a symbol of life and fragility, and that we cannot sort of take anything for granted, because it's, always, it's like hanging um, from the ceiling. It's a wonderful evening. It's been great to be involved in this competition and to meet so many artists from around the world who have submitted their work and been passionate about the theme of peace. And um, it's been wonderful to have so many of them in the gallery this evening and to hear from them about the background to their paintings. And um, yeah, we're really excited to have this exhibition up and to, um, and to have had the event here at the gallery this evening.